never ever give up. It's a great motto for us all to live by, but the phrase was especially important to a select few over at the Duane and Cynthia Willett Children's Hospital earlier this week, where patients were surprised with some special visitors. Oh, 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 <laughs> a little bit of fun and a whole lot of fighting. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. That was the scene at the Children's Hospital this week when patients in the oncology unit were visited by, well, some visitors. The developmental team and the Bananas organization stopped by to spend some time with the kids and deliver joy jars. When you open them up, there's lots of things to keep them entertained. Little toys, little trinkets, cards, anything that, that would be just a little fun day for them. Joy Jars are a concept created by the Jesse Reese Foundation, whose mission is to encourage every kid fighting cancer to never, ever give up, represented by the acronym NIGU. Jesse was just 12 years old when she lost her battle to cancer, but before that, she spent her time creating these Joy Jars for other children who were also in the hospital. Really trying to carry on what Jesse started as a 12-year-old. When she was going through cancer, she started bringing her own toys uh, to the hospital, to the children who couldn't leave. Uh, so since she's passed, just trying to carry that on and spread the joy. Travis first got involved with the foundation through his college baseball program back in 2016. And ever since, he's brought the mission Jesse started to each of the stops along his journey. I think it's important to be involved in this, to really uh, put life into a different lens and perspective, um, and to really see how strong and courageous these kids are that are enduring it and the families that are there supporting them as well. Um, it's really impacted my life and my uh, relationships. The impact is a two-way street as the visit and of course the toys serve as a distraction from the day-to-day -day struggles these kids face. Being able to meet a baseball player is a lot of fun for them and a lot of fun for the families as well and really takes their mind off of what they're going through here in the hospital. To date, over 500,000 Joy Jars have been stuffed and sent to kids fighting cancer in more than 53 countries. Some really great work being done there by Travis and his visitors teammates. And because they do only play when the Bananas Tour and the Party Animals Tour are happening in different cities on the same night, they have a minimal amount of games on the schedule. The last of them starting next Thursday against the Bananas in Indianapolis.